To show the functionality of the grid monitoring, uh, I have chosen the only car I have today, uh, which is our Lander PHIV. So it's maybe not a specially powerful onboard charger. I'm starting charging. So as you see the the grid monitoring control is now green. So grid monitoring is not invoked. Normal speed is 3.3 for this car, but we have a voltage boost, so with the voltage boost we have 3.6, sometimes 3.7. The limitation is now 24 and set is 24. The grid monitoring is started here. Alright, so now I will start, now I will start the fun for the dyno which uses the same power source, so it should load it should load the same power line. Here we have a fun. I just started for five seconds. As you see the grid monitoring now is orange and Speed of charging is 2 kilowatts, so 9 amperes. The system decided to reduce the charging speed. Now the system will analyze what's happened and try to increase the load after some time. Usually it takes up to one minute. Of course when the grid monitoring finishes work, this will change back to green. It means that the additional load at the power lines is not detectable now. Alright, now we decided to do a first step, switch to 12 and check the effects. After another minute we will have full charging speed.